takeoff is I'm going to put the plane into what we call stall configuration. This is called a Harrier. As you can see, the plane, there's a lot of elevator being used right now. And when the plane gets low, I'm going to start adding throttle back to this airplane. And we're going to just keep it up in the air. The plane right now is basically in a stalled configuration. The reason it's not falling is because I'm flexing the throttle. If you listen closely, you can, you can hear the throttle manipulation. The same thing holds true when the plane is inverted. The plane is basically flying very, very slow. Now this plane is specifically designed as a trainer 3D aircraft, so it flies extremely, extremely slow. These planes are very, very capable. With these large flight surfaces, as you'll see, the plane is wonderful on knife edge. And we're going to do a nice knife edge pass. Again, we're going to stall the airplane. We're going to add some throttle, and now we're flying again. This maneuver is the basic maneuver involved in 3D flying that helps you transition into a hover. And we're going to go over a lot more of the stuff that we do in the 3D clinic in a little while. As I transition into a hover, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to add a bit more throttle and a bit more elevator, and eventually the plane is just going to stand right up. It'll tumble. You got it. Twenty dollars for bad service. Another reason for these very large flight surfaces, if you watch, is that you stop the tumble on your side and it's its own frequency. And you have the ability to just start and stop on a gun. Right here. That kind of control is only because of the large flight surfaces. Another part of 3D flight that makes it look really elegant and maneuvers that people love to do, there's a maneuver called the rolling carrier, which is a stalled maneuver again, where the plane is rolling just like this. And we learned how to do that simply by learning to, to fly four point rolls like this. And nice slow roll. I think we're running out of batteries, so we're going to come down. But I hope everyone stops into the 3D clinic when I'm done. And we'll see if we can give you an introduction to this great kind of Sir, understand you're here. All right. <laughs>